I'm very awake today. I hate that word. Awake? Folks. folks. I hate I'm word. awake today, folks. Pal. I say chief. Or guys. Pal chief dude. Dude chief pal. What? Did you guys see my new tongue ring? I think I showed you. I'm backwards. Am I backwards? Where's a word? I need something with a word. Mm. Nope, I'm frontwards, I think. Oh, yeah, that's great. Let everybody know what you're taking. I don't, I'm taking fucking on. hydrochlorothiazide, people. This is for blood pressure, I think. I can't remember anymore. I've been taking them. <laughs> yeah, well, that's great. I wonder why you're, like, I'm, so... Like chipper all the time. No, nah, these are sleepy pills. Oh, okay. See, um, may cause dizziness. And no, that one won't cause anything. That one calls. Shut the fuck up. May cause drowsiness or dizziness. I don't know where my metformin is. Those are like sugar things. Anyway, so short life story. I'm not gonna try to make this very long. Ah, cause this this video is under ten minutes. I am insanely happy. This video so far. Okay. But everybody that's watching is just like, she's not insanely happy, she's just fucking insane. I have a drink. <laughs> it has to be the medication. It just has to be the no. medication. Tim, you're over here all the time. This is normal. I'm just trying to get them, like, well, well, like to understand. <laughs> that I'm not crazy? Yes. When I am? All the time. I'm sure this is even coming out of the bottle. What is wrong with you? <laughs> like, it's an empty bottle. It's awful. There's something in it. It's my favorite smell. I think you smelled it all up. Mm-hmm. That's what I look like when I take a drink. I have smelly pen markers. <laughs> They're cute. They, this one smells you like... Show me your favorite sugar. pen. My favorite pen. What? Sharpie, your... Oh, it's stuff. all the way over there. Fuck it. Oh, you guys gotta see this. Hold on. Everything fell the fuck down. Okay. This is, I got this at a thrift store. Okay. And I had to have it because it has compartments. Look, it's got, this is where all the pencils go. Whoa. <laughs> this is where all the pencils go in this here. And then you press this button here, and that one comes out. And these ones. And then you press this one down here, and I got a sharper. And then you press this one here, and like this is where you change the date, and there's a date there. And then there's a button for that small one right there. And ain't that sweet? I got that for like 60 cents at the thrift store. Wish I sh could show you guys my awesome ass shoes, but they're in the other room, and I'm not getting up. Sue! My eyes look really big right now. This is me without my glasses. Do I look funny? Do I look better with my glasses or without my glasses? You look better with you, baby. You do. He's trying to come one to me. Oh, I should yeah. punch him in his face. Oh yeah, you said about our trip to Amsterdam. Yes, our trip to Amsterdam, where we sold that. I forgot the whole story. You we sold our trip. No, I have it on the the computer. But we sold the, was it a golden dildo to be Arthur? Yes. 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 There's a whole story there. Anyway. It was awesome. But I'm thinking of, okay, I'm getting new glasses, but my mom might buy me some contacts too. I almost thought you were going to say condoms. <laughs> I don't need condoms. I don't use condoms anymore. I'm married. And, uh... <laughs> It was Gabe. I don't know if you guys heard that, but my husband, my husband's singing in the basement, and he was like, "Oh, it is funny." Ew, it is a fart. I mean, he does fart, obviously, like all the time. What is he doing? <laughs> No, he's talking really low and I can't hear him. Uh, like, is these his or yours? These are mine. 
Oh my god, touching your shoe. They are cute. It's okay. Yeah, you know cute. the last time you were on camera, you showed people your shoes too. Yeah? Yeah. Like, I these did. are my shoes, and she picked them out. Where are those shoes? <gasps> They're in my trunk of my car. Do you still wear them? You don't wear them anymore? I'm not old now. I, like, beat the hell out of them. I beat the hell out of my shoes all the time. I mean, look at these motherfuckers. I've been wearing these for years. These are my shoes that I wear. And those are still the cutest shoes on her, too. These are, this is my shoes that I wear. This says Gabe is sexy. It, well, it used to. And then this side says he's up to something because I write random shit on my shoes. And this one says I love Gabe and once upon a time over here. I know I said I'd tell you about my life story, but I haven't got to that yet, we, have we, I? Yeah, we get distracted too easily. And this says this is a shoe. That's what that used to say. And then these, what the fuck is he doing now? Anyway, these are, um... City sneaks and they're red. And I, the pink, you can't even tell they're pink anymore. They're just like dirty white. Oh my god, but tell them how good V8 is. V8 is fucking delicious. I had some V8 today. I drink V8 all the time. I had V8 for like my first time today and it tasted super awesome. I broke his V8 cherry. <laughs> which is kind of redonkulous because. Redonkulous. Yeah, redonkulous because, you know, there's no cherries in V8 because it's like vegetables. <laughs> Uh, I look like Kilroy. What the fuck? Anyway, I'm um I have ADD. You guys should listen to Louis C.K. because he's funny. And now I'm going to try to tell you my life story instead of getting all fucking crazy and shit. Okay, so I was born. I came out of my mom's vagina on March second at like eleven something. I think. Uh, a.m. P.m. P.m. Okay. Or it could have been 7. I can't remember. It's either 7 or 11 something. I think it was... There's numbers and I can't remember them. <laughs> and, um... I don't know what the fuck that was. I'm sorry. Um... Okay, I came on my mom's vagina in 1985. Whoa. And what the hell? What? Your cats were like... Like, 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 over here, like... Smack it. Snap at it or something. Uh, anyway. So I came out of there. And I was born. And I cried a lot. And I had... I did cry a lot. And I had that thing. What's that thing called when you cry a lot and you have to be rocked or you'll keep crying? What's that thing? A rocker in a rocking chair? No, no. There's like this thing that kids have that if you cry, they cry a lot and they need to keep be kept. Colic. I had colic. Oh, I don't remember And that. I fucking kept crying and crying and I was a stupid fucking baby because I kept crying. <laughs> Is that not like normal? I think a lot of babies have it. Well, at least they used to. I don't know. Anyway, so I cried a lot because I was a whiny bitch. Okay, and and then, um, and my family's crazy. Yeah. My mom and dad weren't married until I was, like, nine. And but they loved each other or something <laughs> for a while. They, like, got a divorce when I was ten. But, um, I had this friend. This, I'm, God, this is going to be the weirdest life story ever because I'm going to jump all over the fucking place. I just know I am. Anyway, I had a grandpa. I have two grandpas, obviously. And one grandpa, I call him Papa, and he's like, he's like a bigger guy, and he's got gray hair, and like, he's really handsome for his age, and like, seriously, all the women wanted to do him back in the day, and they still do, because he's like really nice, and he's the funniest guy in the world, and like, he tells stories in great detail, and he's awesome. And he has this wife, and I call her Mamma, but her real name's Donna, and she's mean, and she likes to be mean to people, and she likes to be, um, What's that? Uh, she's kind of, she's anti-homosexual, and she likes to talk about queers, and and she's very racist, and I and I really don't like her sometimes. But uh, like, but she hangs out with lesbians and gay men, and I don't understand it. And like her best friend, like, like is with a bunch of Mexicans. I'm not saying that's bad, but like, if you're racist, you just don't hang out with people that are that other races that you make fun of. That's kind of rude, don't you think? She's very rude. I can't explain to you how rude the bitch is. But, okay, like my grandpa, he worked hard all his life. And he works on cars and he has that, um, he had high blood pressure and he had drinking problems. And, like, he has, like, blood, heart failure thing. He's still alive, but he has, like, whatever that's called. I can't think right now, but, like, and, like, he worked hard to make him money. And he worked hard to get their house that they live in and everything. And she didn't work a day in her life. And she didn't clean. And she didn't cook. And he did fucking everything. And now, 
Now she's got like a job. 